Picture this, the glow of a vintage television set, the room filled with the cozy crackling of anticipation, and a sense of curiosity that dances in the air like a forgotten melody. It was a time when black and white held the power to paint vivid worlds, and every show was an invitation to explore the uncharted territories of storytelling. In the midst of this era, in the year 1961, a charming TV series named Hazel graced the screens. For some, that initial encounter might have been like discovering a treasure trove in their own living room, a delightful escape from the everyday routine. The series, like a good friend, came bearing both comedic charisma and heartwarming wisdom. As the scenes unfolded, it wasn't just the flickering images on the screen that left an impression, but the subtle moments, the candid exchanges, and the sheer authenticity of the characters that lingered in the heart long after the TV was turned off. Perhaps, as you reflect on that time, a smile might sneak onto your lips as you remember those memorable moments, the uproarious laughter caused by Hazel's quirky solutions to household predicaments, the genuine warmth of her interactions with the Baxter family, and the way her unconventional yet endearing demeanor left an indelible mark on your perception of what family truly means. And now, as we step back into the spotlight of nostalgia, let's unveil some intriguing facts about the show that may have slipped through the sands of time. These random tidbits are like hidden gems waiting to be discovered, offering a fresh lens through which to appreciate the show's nuances and the behind-the-scenes magic that brought it all to life. So, let's embark on this journey, a journey that promises to rekindle old memories and light up new corners of your mind with knowledge about the show you thought you knew so well. Buckle up, because we're about to unravel the captivating world of Hazel, where laughter, life lessons, and a touch of vintage charm await. Shirley Booth, the acclaimed actress renowned for her role as Hazel in the 1961 TV series of the same name, added a whimsical touch to the holiday season beyond her beloved character. Following her portrayal of the witty and efficient household maid, Booth lent her voice to the enchanting character of Mrs. Santa Claus in the 1974 film The Year Without a Santa Claus. This transition showcased Booth's versatility, allowing her to capture the essence of both the endearing Hazel and the timeless holiday figure. Beyond the confines of her on-screen roles, Booth's artistry resonated, leaving an indelible mark on entertainment. Shirley Booth's stellar shine, Hazel's triumph at the Emmys in the realm of classic television. The 1961 series Hazel Stands is a remarkable achievement, with Shirley Booth's indelible performance as the titular character, Hazel Burke, at its core. A beacon of heartwarming humor, the show left an indelible mark on the cultural landscape of its time. Amid the spotlight's glare, Booth's talent shone brightly earning her two coveted primetime Emmy Awards. Notably, her first win, a groundbreaking feat, was in the category of outstanding continued performance by an actress in a series. This victory etched her name in history as the inaugural actress to claim this honor. While no publicized feuds marred the show's harmony, it was the chemistry between Booth and her fellow cast members that added to the series' allure. This synergy undoubtedly played a pivotal role in Hazel's enduring success. During its early years, Hazel formed a unique alliance with the Ford Motor Company as the show's sponsor. This partnership wielded its influence in clever ways, notably integrating Ford cars seamlessly into the narrative fabric. The Baxter's family vehicles exclusively sported the Ford emblem, exemplifying a subtle yet effective form of product placement. In a groundbreaking move, Hazel became one of the first shows to showcase the cutting-edge Ford Mustang freshly introduced to the market in the spring of 1964. This strategic depiction of characters behind the wheel of the Mustang underscored the show's keen awareness of cultural shifts and its knack for staying at the forefront of trends. Beyond its charming premise and delightful characters, Hazel epitomized the collaborative brilliance of the era's television production. Shirley Booth's double Emmy triumph, alongside the innovative union with Ford, solidified the show's position as a hallmark of television history. From its inception to its Emmy-adorned journey, Hazel captured hearts and fueled smiles, proving that even the simplest of tales can leave an indelible legacy. Don DeFore's enduring impact beyond the screen Don DeFore, acclaimed for his role as Mr. B in the iconic 1961 TV series Hazel, left a remarkable legacy that extended far beyond the confines of the small screen. Recognized not only for his acting prowess, DeFore was a man of philanthropic dedication, 
co-founding the National Academy of Television Arts and Sciences. He played an instrumental role in shaping the future of television. DeFore's contributions transcended his artistic endeavors. He championed charitable initiatives, demonstrating an unwavering commitment to giving back. His involvement in various humanitarian activities showcased his genuine concern for society's welfare. While his portrayal of the amiable Mr. B entertained audiences, it was his work beyond the studio that truly distinguished him. Beyond the laughter and charm of Hazel, Don DeFore's enduring impact shines as a testament to his altruism. His legacy lives on not only in the memories of fans, but also in the institutions he helped establish and the lives he touched. Enduring traces of Hazel, a glimpse into the series' altered backdrop in the 1961 TV series Hazel. A notable detail in the opening credits unfolds as the titular character passes groceries to the Baxter family. Amidst this scene, a church peeks through the trees, positioned just across from the Stephen house. However, the lens of time holds intriguing stories of transformation for this serene setting. The church in question, nestled at a crosswalk from the Stephen House, met an unfortunate fate in 1970. A fierce fire swept through the renowned Columbia Ranch, inflicting significant damage upon the church structure. As the flames subsided, the church lay leveled, leaving a void in the landscape. Columbia Studios, not to be deterred by adversity, chose to resurrect this spiritual cornerstone. A new church emerged from the ashes, painstakingly rebuilt to recapture its former charm. Curiously, as the opening credits showcased the Baxters and Hazel strolling away from a vibrant red convertible, a shift in perspective revealed the intricacies of reconstruction. The church, it appeared, was not restored in its original location, but instead took root in the distance, beyond the tree that graced the backdrop. Fast forwarding to the present day, a digital cartographic expedition via Google Maps showcases a landscape altered by time's touch. While the tree has vanished from the scene, the lawn stands as a testament to meticulous care, in stark contrast to the fictional family's treatment. In this poignant glimpse into Hazel's history, the interplay of fire and rebirth, both on screen and off, unveils a narrative as intricate as the characters themselves. The church's displacement, a subtle yet profound transformation, beckons us to ponder the cyclical nature of change and renewal. Flamboyant flair, unraveling the mystique of Hazel opening credits in the annals of television history. Few series hold the power to capture an audience's attention like the 1961 TV gem Hazel. Amidst its many quirks and charms, one element stands out, the enigmatic evolution of its opening credits. A true visual journey, these credits underwent a transformation that continues to perplex and enthrall viewers. At the heart of this metamorphosis lies an inexplicable curiosity, the opening song's crescendo aligning seamlessly with the appearance of Whitney Blake. With each introduction of the talented actress, her name descends on the screen with a flamboyant flair that defies explanation. Was it a calculated move to echo the vivacity of the show's titular character? Or perhaps a reflection of the vibrant era's penchant for theatricality? Whitney Blake's name became synonymous with this captivating credit sequence, leaving audiences entranced by the unexpected synergy between sight and sound. The show's producers remained tight-lipped about the artistic choices, allowing the sequence to take on an aura of mystery that endures to this day. As we delve into the captivating world of Hazel, let us not forget this emblematic opening, where Whitney Blake's name, accompanied by a flamboyant flair, etched itself into television history. Silencing the struggles, breaking the mental health taboos in Hollywood, and supporting Hazel's cast member in the glittering realm of Hollywood, where fame casts its blinding glow. The shadows of mental health struggles often remain concealed. The 1961 TV series Hazel might have exuded charm on screen, but behind the scenes, a cast member grappled with the isolation and loneliness intrinsic to stardom, leading to a harrowing battle with depression. The entertainment industry has long been notorious for stifling discussions about mental health. The cast member, whose vibrant performances captured hearts, found themselves ensnared in this silence. The relentless pressure to maintain an image, coupled with a demanding shooting schedule, created a perfect storm for their inner turmoil. As they smiled for the cameras, their cries for help reverberated unheard. Their journey mirrors the plight of countless stars who, amidst fame's glare, confront their demons alone. Despite the glitz and glamour, many celebrities tread a lonely path, 
their cries muffled by the facade of perfection. The cast members' struggles sent shockwaves through Hollywood, a reminder that even amidst adoration, battles rage within. However, the tale took a turn as they bravely decided to break the chains of stigma. Their public acknowledgement of their mental health challenges marked a turning point, shattering the taboos that have ensnared the industry for decades. As their story unraveled, a chorus of support arose from fellow actors and fans alike, creating ripples of change. Their journey of resilience serves as a beacon of hope for a new era in Hollywood, one where mental health is not confined to shadows. The cast members' courage illuminated the need for an open dialogue prompting studios to reevaluate their support systems. It is a stark reminder that the silver screen sparkle belies the human struggles that persist behind it. In the realm of make-believe, where stories are spun and characters crafted, the cast members' battle was as real as it gets. Their legacy extends beyond their roles, becoming a catalyst for dismantling the barriers that have silenced the cries of those suffering in the spotlight. As Hollywood inches towards a more compassionate future, the cast member's journey stands as a testament to the power of vulnerability. This is part of our ongoing series on mental health in Hollywood, where we shed light on the untold stories behind the stars, their battles, their triumphs, and the path to a more inclusive industry. Because every story deserves to be told, no matter how silent the struggles. As we bid adieu to the captivating world of Hazeland, we find ourselves not only parting ways with a TV series, but with a trove of memories that have become intertwined with the tapestry of our lives. The yearning gazes exchanged between characters, the subtle nuances of each episode's plot, and the timeless emotions it stirred within us, all of these have etched a unique path within our hearts. Hazeland wasn't just a series, it was an expedition into the landscapes of our emotions. It unraveled narratives that resonated with our own personal journeys, inviting us to reflect on our desires, dreams, and dilemmas. The moments of laughter and tears it brought forth were like echoes of our own lives, painting our experiences with the brushstrokes of its storyline. As we take this final bow with Hazeland, it's not just a farewell to the characters we've come to know, but also an invitation to keep those memories alive. Share your thoughts, your favorite scenes, and the moments that tugged at your heartstrings. Let's create a collective tapestry of emotions that mirrors the impact Hazeland had on us all. So, dear friend, whether you found solace in its narratives or drew parallels with your own life, your connection with Hazeland is an intimate and personal tale worth sharing. Your stories are the continuation of the legacy this series leaves behind, a testament to its power to bind us through pixels and emotions. Thank you for being part of this journey, for letting Hazeland touch your life in its own unique way. Your time and interest have made this experience all the more remarkable. Until we cross paths again, remember that every moment lived in the world of Hazeland is a page etched in the story of our hearts. With heartfelt gratitude, 